is I want to do this last night. There are tickets, and I also... Whoa, what's the trouble? What's that? How's that fast? How the heck are you, everybody? I am Fastidious. Let's frickin' beat faction trials. So for the longest time, I've only had Northerners remaining, or so I thought. Uh, turns out, somewhere along the line, I missed two stars in Infernal. So I'll have to wait uh, one more day tomorrow. I'll have to do probably going to be like Infernal 9 or something. Snag two more stars. So you'll see at the very end, you'll probably just see me beating it. It's going to be the easiest thing in the world for my account. Uh, and then we will end this video with whatever random Legendary Pact hero I get from the Legendary Hero Pact. However, the real challenge is going to be Trial of the Northerners. If you guys don't know, forever I was hoping for Shamir because there's a very silly rule here. You need to deploy three mages. And not counting Ajax, who you cannot count on having, who can be in any faction, there are only three freaking Northern mages in the game. <laughs> Simple as that. Uh, so I desperately needed Shamir for a long time, and of course I pulled him uh, during the nascent summoning. If you guys missed that, go check it out. I did. Also, I'm live on twitch.tv forward slash fastidious underscore gg right now, so if you ever want to see me live, definitely drop a follow and join my Discord. You'll get the notifications as soon as I go live. But then, of course, I pull him, and like two weeks later, I pull him again. So you guys might be wondering, why haven't I beaten this yet? I'm saying I pulled Shamir like three weeks ago, and I pulled him again last week. I was moving, uh, I feel like Northerners keeps being on the weekend, uh, I keep saying I'm gonna do it in my head and then not doing it, we're doing it right now! We're doing it right now, we got 52 people in the chat here on Twitch, I really appreciate it, it's pretty late on a Sunday night, 7.45, as I said that, the clock changed, 7.45pm Utah time, that would be like 9.45pm in New York, I mean we're talking like 3.45am Central European, so we're cooking, we're cooking, anyone that's here, you're a hero. I appreciate it. Serby is saying, hi, YouTube. I don't put chat on my on my YouTube videos. I don't show Twitch chat on my YouTube videos, let's be honest. All right, let's get after it. It's 11.45 a.m. in Australia. Shout out to Fcos. All right, let's get after it. I'm going to show you the gear really fast. I have never really done this. I haven't pushed this at all. Um, I have amazing heroes for it, obviously. Um, I'm actually not even going to bring Ardia. It's not how the strat, I see it in my head. Um, I just moved some gear around. You can see I have a nearly maxed out A2 uh, Valkyra, just missing the revive, which I don't care about, and a little bit of basic attack damage, which I kind of care about, but we have more than enough. She's in my Zeal 2's gear. Good stuff. 15 1, 1 1.3 second interval, capped at 329. No Rage Gem, which is annoying. I'm rocking her in uh, Glacial Wings just to give consistent shields. So basically, as long as she's not ulting, she'll keep placing three second shields on her. I feel like there's a move that I should go Flawless Blade, or I should go Void Gazer. I'm just going to rock her in her uh, in her exclusive. Why not? I do want to show you guys, I got this piece yesterday. Best Infernal Roar piece on my account. Of course, the huge gold roll landed on flat defense. But actually, if you look at it, crit rate's the least important, because of course, I'm at the point where I can crit cap, crit cap all my heroes. Because I'm, I mean, like a lot of late and endgame players, especially endgame players like myself, I'm hunting crit on all my DPS stuff. But getting these enormous, literally borderline gold rolls on crit damage and attack speed. It's probably the best piece on my account. I won't say it's the best, actually, just because Soulbound is the best set. But just pound for pound, this is probably the best piece. I love it. I love it. So I just wanted to show that off. We'll go a lot faster through the other ones. Nocturne is in a very nocturne -y build. Not a lot of crit damage, but attack quite high and tons and tons of attack speed. Uh, he's at 569. I just want him attacking all the time for as many opportunities to land uh, true damage as we can. A 1.2 second interval. This guy is rapid. He's a max out tier of Twilight. Infernal Roar is good for him. I, honestly, I didn't overthink this stuff too much. This is literally my Vladov gear for Arena. I run Vladov just in tanky Invig. He's my leader since I don't have an ancient exclusive legendary lord like Gon or Valderon, so I run Vladov. So he just went for really high HP. The stats aren't good. 35 heal effect, 205 attack speed. It's not great. Who cares? We're cooking. We're cooking. Hearts is in decent guardian. I don't have very good guardian gear, but it'll be fine. I, I believe in myself. If you believe in yourself, guys, you'll always find a way. 103,000 HP. We're talking 7,400 flat attack. He is rocking a plus 19 Bastion Ring. While we're here, I'll show you that we've got a maxed out plus 22 Bastion Ring on Broke here. He's in slightly better HP gear. We got this really nice defense piece. When I say really nice, I mean it exists and I have it. Uh, I don't. Have, I think it's the only good defense bonus main within at any HP bonus sub on Guardian on my entire account. Hunting for defense and HP over here. It all shook out really nice. 96k uh, and then 10.5k defense. 10.5k defense might be overkill, but nothing is going to kill this broke here. And let's see. There is Maul. I think I just threw... I want to say this is Arrogance's gear. I just threw it on him. Attack is low, but we're going to be fine. Just believe in yourself. Like I said, 
Uh, we'll be we'll be a okay. Well, I think I've got a better. Yes, we'll put this sharpshooter's crescent on him. He's obviously gonna do a lot of AOE. He should be pretty far away from the enemies. I showed you Valkyra. Mari's in my always Mari build. I hope that she's tanky enough. She's only at tw twenty and a half k HP. If she's not, I can quickly swap something else in. You know what? Let's just already do that uh, preemptively. So let's just. I don't care about broken sets. It sucks to lose the Rager gem, but whatever. Uh, there you go. So let's see. Actually, can I look for flat HP too? No, I don't have any options. What did that bring her to? 25305. She's in a max our Nightmare Samsara. Very, very fast though. Uh, 598. We lost a little bit because that other one had a huge attack speed roll, but I'm happy enough. That's Mari. Let's keep it moving. We've got Gwenny Gwenny over here. Uh, she is in, I think, I just showed you Gwenny Gwenny. She's in, yes, of course, she's in Vladov's gear. Uh, Vortex is in his normal gear. Why am I all over the place? Vortex is in his normal gear. You can see HP, speed. It's fine. Invig's important. Shamir, piping fast. I put him in uh, Hex's gear, actually. Probably not the best gear for Hex since he doesn't need that much HP. Actually, just looking at this, uh, can I get a little more attack? Yes, we can. Let's just snag this from Cerberus. This is better. All right, 11.2. It's a little low, but we'll be good. It's still super fast at 46.1. 46.1. What am I saying? 461 uh, attack speed. And another max out Nightmare Samsara. We want him going quick. I think that's everything. Let's get into it. Let's just see how I do. Um, I would say no backseating to the chat, but I don't care. I'm not going to look. I'm just going to keep my head down and try to get this done. First things first, uh, we're going to place Valkyra right about there. Uh, actually, we want her one up, I think. So you'll see, as soon as she starts basic attacking, she's got a shield on herself. She just got a bigger one from hearts, but now if we ever did want to trigger, we're good to go. Well, she's always going to have shield on her as long as she's not ulting. Um, I'm not... Of all the faction trial stages, this is by far the one I've known the least. I've neglected it because I knew I would never be able to three-star it. That's all going to change today. Um, I do know generally how they all come down, but not so, so well. Let's get Broke here down here. This would be a good spot for Ardia if I wanted to use her, putting her behind, but I just don't think we need it. Let's let him tank for a bit. Let's let Vortex... Yeah, is this good? No, I want Vortex over there. Let's get Gwen here. I think it's better. Let's get some shields up. Ooh, maybe I should have done Vortex. No, we should be good with Gwen. She's not fast enough, is she? We wait, we wait, we wait. I think this is going to be a nice spot for Shamir. I, first time I've ever used Shamir. That's the first deploy ever. Let's see the damage. Not great. It is what it is. It is what it is. Let's get Gwenny going. Let's go. Wait, I think Mari should go here. That's kind of where I want Nocturne. I just don't want her here. Let's just wait till we get closer. We're going to feel it all out. See, there she's got the shield on. Ooh, broke your died. Something I didn't think would happen. Damage sucks up there, as you can see. So we'll have to do something a bit better. A bit better build. Yeah, we got to do better. Uh, I think I think Gwendolyn was the wrong move, quite frankly. Uh, let's instantly pivot. Instantly pivot. I'm going to get mid on in the mix. Mid on in the mix. We go, we go. I'm going to leave this unedited. You're gonna, What you see is what you get for this one. You know, If it takes 10 more minutes, great. If it takes an hour, great. There's no way it will take more than an hour. Will I eat those words? Who knows? We'll see. Um, all right, mid on. I already was bringing mid on, looks like. <laughs> all right, sure. Let's keep it going. Yeah, Gwen needs more speed for sure. Uh, this, I'm, You see, I didn't even show you this because I forgot I even geared her. This is absolute dog water. Um, let's go like this. Anything good? Yeah, we'll, we'll just snag broken set, premium looking pieces. This one's nice. Nice. Okay, way better. So rage through the roof, attack speed through the roof, HP still looking pretty nice. Wish it was a little higher, but I mean, that's life. You know, you don't always get what you wish for. Um, believe it or not, that three triple healer on her uh, basic, this counts as single target. So definitely, and Legion Epitaph is a strong choice for mid on, just like with Elowin. For Gwenny, let's put a little attack speed amulet on her. Let's see. I think he's got HP hiding out on them. Uh, this one's on Vortex. Okay, let's just snag this from Hollow then. I'm breaking up all my builds. Definitely when you do stuff like this, try to pre-save a lot of your builds and your gear plans. It's definitely something I've been doing more and more lately. Uh, and it definitely can kind of save you the headache as you do it. Just, you know, being in the back here. Oh my god, I'm going to have to redo all of this. So get a nice amount of gear plans saved. I can still improve a lot on it. Um, this looks all right. Hmm, I'm trying to think if there's anything else I want to do. I feel like that Shamir build was bad. <laughs> his, I didn't land anything in his ult, which is bummer. But, uh, you know what? Yeah, let's get more attack here. See, I don't have to worry about this, because I know I can just put my other build back on. Uh, 
Ooh, we can get nice. This is cool. Yeah, let's snag that from Comet. And now I can load that other build right on to Hex when we need it. Still at 11.2. I didn't really change anything. I'm hoping the Tier of Twilight carries us. He's lightning quick at 423. Um, no, I want attack. Let's go for Warlord. I don't even know if I gained anything there. Uh, let's snag that. Yeah. And yeah, let's snag that from Maul. We don't care too much about Maul for what we're doing. Yeah, now 12.5. That's feeling better. Still 378. I think it's okay. Let's hop back down to Maul over here. Let's get some more attack speed on Maul. Oh, their chat is telling me my Shamir is not promoted. <laughs> is that true? Am I that foolish? Uh, uh, this is a mistake I've made before for getting to promote my heroes. Uh, not even close. Oh my god, I stink. Yeah, okay, so he doesn't even have his passive up. That's so funny. Um, wild. Wild. So he's not going to be doing any major DPS for us. So actually, he needs just a straight support build. I'm not going to promote him, though. I think it's like whatever. He's there literally just to be a third mage. If I need to, then we'll take a break and I'll farm mats. But I don't want to do that. So let's keep going. I do think I want to swap that other... Ah, Maul looks good enough. Who cares? Honestly, who cares? Let's just do it. Let's see. Good call from Trevindem, though. Uh, <laughs> I made that mistake with my odds. Uh, when I actually I beat uh, when I beat Gear uh, Dungeon Two, aka Gear Eight Five, I my odds was promo five, and I just didn't even realize till the commenter, I believe it was Joseph, told me. So that's life. Hoping we can get by enough time with them all with some slows. This is the new plan, guys. Let's land some slopes. Come on, buddy. Yeah, we're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're good. We're going to place Vortex here now. Uh, no, you know what? We're going to place Min on. Place mid on. All right, let's get a little pushback. Buy ourselves a little time. I mean, the damage is better. It's not good at all. Um, let's get the heals. Is it enough? We'll see. Who knows? 1x this. Wow. I mean, we are getting clobbered. This is crazy. Um, let's get Shamir there. Get a little pushback by us some time. Useless. Useless. Let me actually read. How did the how did Midon die? Uh, the soul burn shield inflicts continuous damage on the enemy that blocks the unit surrounded by the shield. When destroyed, the shield's massive damage to all nearby enemies. Okay, got it. Bad choice then, I guess. I don't know. Let's keep going. Well, we're living and learning. I do not know this stage well. I don't, I'm not even going to sell this as a guide. This is going to be a watch me do it. <laughs> That's going to be the video. Damage is uh, really bad for Maul. It's really, really not good. I really didn't think my... I guess I need more attack. I did not think this build was so bad. At all. Actually, maybe Mari would have been a better choice there. Let's see. Down goes... See, but... Oh, just when the shield pops at all. Okay. Sick. Cool. Um, let's just actually leave it. I want to see what this damage looks like. From That's crazy, actually. Um, I guess we need to just space everything out way, way more. Um, okay, let's, let's, let's we gotta rebuild Maul. I think Maul can do this. Um, but... Or maybe Nocturne's even a better choice. Hmm. So probably there's a crit damage, yes, there's a crit damage piece I can lose. Let's go to attack bonus. Mm, that's going to be a big crit damage loss. Let's actually just sort by Soulbound. Nope, sir. Yeah, we don't... Whatever, Shamir, dude. You're not even promoted. Get with the program. Get with the program, bro. You're not even promoted. Uh, there's got to be an attack speed one. Let's just snag that. He's a support unit now. Who cares? Who cares? Mm, onward and upward, I think. I think it's fine for now. Trying to think ahead to who the no deploys are going to be. I mean, we'll probably not really use Shamir that much. That would be my guess. Um, let's try again. Wait, so what is he? What's he at now? 11-4. I mean, it feels better. Is it good? I don't know, but it feels better. We can do two more enhances here. Snag another 60 flat attack. Let's hop back in. Yeah, people in chat are talking about Ardia. I don't really want to use Ardia. I feel like... Not that this is going to be a guide guide, but it's, it's going to be strictly unrelatable content if I start using Ardia. 
That's my thinking, at least. Crazy. So Vortex just can't even tank that, which is actually crazy. I've got I've got a lot to learn about this age. Uh, Ten was really really easy when I did it. I don't know months ago. So I thought this would be easy, um, but clearly there's a lot of finesse to this. So grown pains, baby. Let's get it done. Uh, I'm shocked at at the amount of DPS they're putting out. Quite frankly, I mean this is a good build on my broke here. Um, hmm. Think a little bit harder. I think Valp can handle the bottom completely by herself. That's my theory. Doesn't even need healing. I don't think anything's gonna reach her. At least for this, what I'm seeing so far. So. Okay. We're gonna hold her ult to take better advantage. Um, then I'm gonna place. Yeah, she can just get this kill. It doesn't matter. 1x this. Um, get broke here, there. And then ideally, I think we want to buff Maul. I'm assuming it's all adjacent tiles. So if I have like Maul and this here, right? It won't be an explosion. I'll put broke here back, uh, Vortex back here. I just can't, I can't believe how much damage broke here is taking, man. Let's just try to power through it. He's going to freeze in a second. Let's see. Watch the ult. It's not even going to land. Of course not. It lands on... Okay, so none of the waiting mattered at all. Healing up. I mean, these guys put out a ridiculous amount of damage. It's a little pushback. All right. We're getting damage going now. Give me an ult. Cool. She can just do that. I had a feeling. Nice. I somehow held on. Let's see. Are these the same? It's the same thing. Are you freaking serious? And so, so like mid on. Well, I guess I have mid on and Gwendolyn. That's why, right? All right. So I think what we do is we go like this. I'm thinking Nocturne can just delete these guys completely. That's my plan. At least we've made progress. Okay. If they're coming one at a time, it's I don't think it's such a huge issue. 9 out of 31. Much, I think, if I'm not mistaken, I think it's much longer than the previous ones I've done. Wow, mid on just instantly dead. Completely useless is the only way you could describe her. Yep, okay, they're going to start popping me. Right, at least they're not going for... Interesting. Ah, I don't like this one bit. Definitely there's some cycling that could be done here. Uh, let's just trigger Nocturne. Delete some people, please. Yeah, mid on beyond useless is what she was. Uh, here's Valkyra. That that's, that exclusive for Valkyra is coming in so clutch, huh? We don't have to worry about anything. An actual delete button. <laughs> Completely ridiculous. Uh, right now we have Hoodie, Hoodius. Hoodius with the first time chat. Thank you so much for the first time chat. If you want to come, it's 100% free to follow, to chat, to all do, do all that good stuff here on twitch.tv forward slash Vestidius underscore GG. Uh, yeah, I've got a million tips for a beginner, but not right now. I'm clearing content. Uh, ask me in an hour. Let's trigger. Let's wait till everyone's in range. Wait, this many people are coming? Are you joking? What the heck? Oh, at least there's a countdown. I right, start picking people off, baby. Come on. Give me some shields. Wow, this is crazy. Oh my gosh. Definitely a cycle opportunity here. We could bring like a vortex instead. Give me a little push. Boy's almost ready to ult. Give me a little Gwendolyn action. Mm. He is ready to ult. All right, I think I'm gonna. I'm just gonna kind of power through this. One way or another, that's the sense I get. I think we're. I think we're about to power through. Come on, Nocturne, just delete some people. Give me a freeze, Mari. What's the range on that ultimate? Come on, girl. Yeah, everywhere. Why not? 
And now Midon comes in. Yay. How did how did how did Gwendolyn die? We'll never know. We'll never know. So Shamir, the role Shamir filled for us guys. There we, I mean what that was only like three or four tries, huh? Um No hero killed? Oh, I hate this game. I mean, I should have looked, but are you serious? I knew the rules for 12, and then, of course, they're just different here. So, I can't win. I can't... Well, this is going to be a different kind of video, folks. So, I thought tomorrow I'd just head into Infernals and miss, get snag the missing two crystals or whatever you call them over here. Uh, no, I won't. No, I won't. I won't do that. Because I only have one attempt a day now because they changed those rules. So actually what's going to happen is it will probably grind out 12 now. I'll do that. But then I'll have to wait another, what, six or seven flipping days till this comes back around. Can fight it again, can't I? Yeah, I fight it again and I lose my attempt. It only didn't count because that was a first time clearance. I'll lose my attempt and then I can't do 12. So uh, that's clownery and I hate it. That stinks. Wow. That stinks so bad. They're saying I can redo 11 after a beat 12? Really? Oh, you get a free... Oh, I get a free attempt on 12. Okay, let's... Okay. Everything changed. So deploy three mages, soul core intact, win. That's it. That, so let's try the same thing. We'll see how geared we are, how good we feel. Uh, this this sweet guy needs better, right? I mean, I, this is a good build, man. I, I, I think Valk is still beyond ridiculously fine for this, so let's see. Um, all right, that's sweet. Okay. Let's see. Let's see. I mean, good news is because the invig is just never going to work the way we, we want it to. She gonna die? <laughs> cool. <laughs> this is so stupid. <laughs> oh my gosh. The invig's never gonna work the way we want it to, is what I was saying. So if we're feeling like we're close, I can just change Vortex's gear to not be invig gear. Do like a Sclepius or something. I don't know. Cause yeah, I think the order this is gonna have to go, assuming these guys completely punish broke here. It's going to be I have to place Vortex now anyway. Yeah, this is how it has to go. I mean, look how much damage they put out. It's crazy. 10.5k defense. How much are they hitting me for? 34. Overtuned. Overtuned to high heavens. That's crazy. That is completely crazy. He's going to pop, isn't he? I, mean, I guess that's why he's good that he is the... Yeah, we're going to need more attacks. Oh, my God. He's going to die right now. Get that freaking ult. Nope, no ult. He just died. Ridiculous. <laughs> so stupid. Oh, my gosh. All right, let's get Shamir like this, I guess. Oh, maybe that will help us. Who knows? Nothing matters. Life's a lie. Wow, this, this actually, this exclusive for Valkyrie has become ridiculously clutch. Yeah, she's a delete button. Who just died? Of course he did. Why not? Why wouldn't, like, this completely goaded... What is going on? All right, let's read these guys more properly. The Soulborn Shield inflicts continuous magic damage on the enemy that blocks the unit surrounded by the shield. When destroyed, the shield deals massive damage. I mean, what is the... I mean, I guess I can get a better build on Vortex, but what is the solution? I mean... I don't know, man. I don't know. I don't know. Viceroy in chat talking about Shamir. Uh... Bro. Silly. Um, all right. Let's just see. How much better? I mean, is this build that good? It's not that good, right? I mean, this is not bad. 1.6 seconds with four. I mean, this is... Pfft. All right. Let's get it going like this. What is this piece anyway? No attack. Whatever. Alright, so just uh, to HP, 
heal effect, attack speed, to the moon. Let's go. Yep. Yep. All right, so we are at... How is it? Everything's lower. I, just because we missed the, the extra 10%. Three, I mean, everything's worse. I don't get it. Dang. Dang! Um, who did I just take off from mid on? I think it was. Yes, all right. Craziness. Ridiculous craziness. Um, I don't understand how my broke gear just dies like that easily. I mean, I'm very happy with this build. I don't get it. Makes no sense. Let's keep going. Yeah, an idea is we could put Mari here. Uh, since we, I don't think I don't know if we're gonna need her. If Noc Nocturne kind of was just completely deleting. Um, yeah, I don't know. Wow, I mean that's nuts. So he's healing for 24k. I'm getting hit for 34k. Broke here never gets his ult ready in time. And I'm hitting for nothing now with Maul, too. So maybe, what are these guys? What's these guys? Do these guys need magic damage? Uh, no, they're equally not, not supposed to be tanky at either, and yet somehow they're they're godly at everything. Right. The, the heals seem better, right? Am I crazy? Because he's going to get his ult off this time. Are you going to get your ult off, big boy? Can you get it off for me, please? Nope. It's incredible. The timing's just incredible. Let's try if we put Mari here. We get some vulnerabilities. Will that give us some time? I wish you could have a countdown on this, but of course not. They don't tell you anything in Watcher Realms. That's kind of how the game works. They're like, what if we didn't tell you anything? Cool. Cool. <laughs> cool. 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 That's ridiculous. Um, yeah, let's try Nocturne instead. We need to change something. This isn't working, obviously. Yeah, maybe maybe it is because we're getting AoE from Maul. He's killing them. He's breaking all the shields at the same time, so the big boom is too big, if you know what I mean. Too big. Some people. It's a problem you just have to live with your whole life, you know. It's rough. It's rough out there. It's rough in these streets, guys. It is. I just can't believe that the 10.5k defense with all these resistances and stuff, a maxed out Bastion Wall, and they're hitting me for 34k. I honestly can't believe it. I just can't believe that. All right, let's see. Big hits from big boy. Nope, he's gonna die. I mean, he's he, every time he's just able to not get his ult off. Look, uh, do it, I got it. Oh my God, I got it. Wow, I should complain more. Complaining works, don't you think? Don't you think complaining just works? It really does. Um, all right, so Maul will go here then. And I'm not going to ult, because Nocturne's doing this by himself. Definitely good shot with Nocturne. Let's see. Yeah, Valk can just delete these guys. She's crazy. <laughs> She's nuts. Completely nuts. She's crazy. She's nuts. She's crazy. She is just nuts. Just crazy. Um, I'm realizing now I should have placed Mari first. Oh, they take some time anyway. It's fine. Yeah, I want to save the Nocturne ult for what's coming. I don't know if he's going to be ha able to handle them all when they when they come like crazy. All 
Alright, we're doing good. Eight kills. She's gonna die from the shield just from one explosion. No, you're fine, babe. Come on. You're fine. You can take one one explosion? <laughs> what? <laughs> oh my god, dude. It's unbelievable. Are you kidding me? That's ridiculous. Oh my goodness. Yeah, let's see if Mari can just completely spam. That's what I'm wondering. Let's go... This is fast. She's fast. Let's just get Mari completely spamming. That's the plan now. Is this mall build going to be good enough? I feel like it's not. Alright, so we'll do that. We got Mari... Are you an invig? All right, I don't know. We'll see. Um, let's keep seeing. What I don't like is this is like a like these stage, it just it, every stage feels like completely different because of how big the the jump is. So it's like everything I've learned before isn't really helping me. <laughs> but I suppose that's the puzzle of it all. Is much she doesn't get a kill this what is going on, dude? It hasn't even been close. What is going on? Someone tell me what's going on. I don't get it. She didn't consume the shield, is that it? How did she not consume a shield? No, you're good. See, what, what, <laughs> that was exact. Oh my gosh, dude. Oh, right, freaking dumbass vortex. I can't believe how hard these little jerks hit. I can't believe it. I actually can't. It's shocking to me is what it is. Completely shocking. He's dead. Unreal, man. Let's see if Mari can keep it so slow. I mean, this damage is, is absolute comedy. What, what was that? Oh, the shield broke? Is that what that was? Well, now he's... crazy just kill these fools smoke these fools baby come on all right somehow i think maybe come on mall push him back buy yourself some time baby come on now is that too late that might have been too late all right this is the move mari up there we no tank up there maybe we'll keep hearts as like a contingency plan It's looking good. Probably going to 1x in a second. This is one way to do it, maybe. I don't know. Come on, kill these fools. Smoke these fools, baby. Smoke these fools. Shield. Be 
These fools looking to get smoked. These fools looking to get smoked. These fools are gonna get smoked. These fools are gonna get smoked. So how are Nocturnes getting hit? Explain that. Explain that to me. How the how on God's green earth? What the heck? Nice. All right. So we handled that side. Uh, it didn't say anything about no deaths. Deaths. It said core intact. It said clear it. It said three mages. And I think we did it. Yeah, boy! Just like I drew it up. Not even that long. We did it. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. That's one way to do it. And Quaz is, I think, correct. We can go back now. And indeed, since that's a first clear, it should not consume my key. Which means we're right on track, just like we drew it up. If we check the chalkboard right back there, you can't see it because of the virtual green scene. There's a very elaborate chalkboard. And yes, we have one more attempt. We can go here, we clear it tomorrow, or maybe at day's end. I will knock out Infernal. Uh, I, I think it must be stage eight, nine or stage 10, and then we will claim the sweet, sweet card. All right, there we go. There we go. So we have to wait a couple hours, but at least it's not too crazy. Uh, we'll see. Right after this, I'm doing a Titanic Ruins stream on YouTube, YouTube Live. I also stream there, so make sure you're subbed on YouTube. Um, and if that goes really long, <laughs> then I will have to, maybe I'll still be awake and I'll knock out the Infernal very quick. If it's Shamir, that would be the funniest thing ever. But also, screw you, Freak Shadow. <laughs> All right, so this one is no deaths. No deaths, no problem. All right. I think now I know enough that it's okay. Imagine I never get Shamir, I finally do, I can do this. In the interim between when I actually go to attempt it, I pull another Shamir, and then I finally get the card, and it's another Shamir. That would be torturous. I have A1 Shamir. This is A1 Shamir. You missed the news, apparently. Uh, if I have, if they kill someone, I'll just restart. That's That's all it is. Well, broke gear might die. What an absolute jerk. How do these guys hit so hard? It's unthinkable to me. It's it's wild. I don't understand how they hit that hard. This is gonna be hard. Honestly, this is gonna take me a few tries. I can tell already. I'm not saying Shamir's bad, but I don't need an A2 Shamir right now. Like, I, I still have a million lords I don't have. Um, I could use a Salazar, I could use Razak, I could use Fairsi. I mean, there's just so many, so many more useful options for me, right? Shield's done, nice. Yep, tank that, Gwen. Tank it, Gwenny! Come on, Gwenny! Tank it, girl! Let's go. Buy yourself some time, baby. Come on, now! Well, that's a monstrous shield. Holy guacamole. Uh, the dev video of mine will drop either tomorrow or the next day. 
People are asking about my dev interview and the roadmap plan. Uh, I'm, I'm hoping I hear back from them like now. I'm waiting for them to wake up uh, Monday morning in China. Then we'll work out the last bit. So far so good, baby. All right, we're looking good. No one's dead on the right, that's nice. Let's 1x this, let's get Mari. We just can't have these shields all popping at once. Gwen, get yourself. No! All right, I think instead of Gwen, we're gonna, we're gonna use mid on and we're gonna make her so HP, it's gonna be crazy. That's the plan. We know the right side is fine. Um, all right, so let's go like this. Actually, I have a better idea. I had an extra deploy the whole time. What if we did both? And then I can just, yeah, maybe? Is that a, I don't know, is that a good idea? Maybe? Uh, that looks pretty good. And then what do you got over here? Noish, schnorris. Very, very schnorris, very, very schnorris, very, very schnorris. Very, very schnorris, very, very schnorris, schnorris. Let's go here. All right, nice. All right, so mid on is a little tank. 52.9, this looks good. Gwenny, um, where are you, Gwenny, baby? Let me get your HP up a little bit. Uh, her defense is at 17.6. Let's get her more defense. All right. So now her defense is at 25.7. At still 49.2. I think this will work. I'm feeling good about this. All right, I think this is going to be it, guys. And somehow our viewer numbers are going up. We're at 62 on Twitch, very late on a Sunday night. I appreciate you guys so much. I also want to say, you know, don't count your chickens before you hatch, but we're doing very well in the content creator of the year voting. Uh, so one of the mods will link the, the, the voting for that. If you have yet to vote, they can link that. Earl or Vice or Matt, whomever's there, can link that in the chat. Um... But yeah, uh, we're winning, so that's very, it's a big, it'd be a big honor, it's very fun. Um, and yeah, I have something pretty big planned that I wanted to do that would be like for like the creator of the year that's like under a thousand subs, because I feel like Moonton just ignored a lot of people. Um, and you know, it's hard including everybody. Basically, I was thinking I could make, we could make our own little competition and I could, I could give people a little monetary prize or something. I thought that'd be pretty fun. Um, so that's something, let me know in chat what you think of that, let me know in the comments, I guess. I mean, if you're commenting on this, I probably already have decided if I'm doing that, but I think that could be pretty cool. Let's see. Thank you for sharing the poll in the chat, Matt. So if you guys haven't voted yet, uh, you can vote for five creators, so vote for your five favorites. If I'm not one of them, no worries, that's life, baby. I know fool, my mom didn't raise on fool. Can you just not die, though? Like, just don't die. Just get your ult off before you die. That's all I'm saying. Just get your ult off before you die. Just get your ult off before you die. Yeah, boy. See? See how nice that is when you do it? Do you see how nice that is when you actually do it? All right. So I'm hoping Gwenny's tanky enough to survive one explosion. Then we'll have extra heals from mid on. And then Mari won't be in such need. A little something like this. Whoa, wait, what's this? Oh, I never ulted with her. Frick, it's over. Jeez!
I gotta pay attention. I gotta focus. I gotta focus. I bought a ficus. I was a little late, but I think that for, yeah, for stage 11, we should be fine. Let's get this guy going. Take me home tonight. I don't want to let you go no summer night. Take me home tonight. I don't say the loop and the lead in the day. Just like a runaway. See my little baby. Come on, buddy. Yes. Okay, let's get that off. Nice. Feels good to ult. It feels very good to ult. Let's get that going. Nice. I'm not going to make that mistake again. Okay, uh, let's get you down. People in chat are saying the portals look weird. Yeah, my graphics might be low. My computer was overheating earlier. Guys, I, life is difficult from a laptop, all right? It's not, 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 it's not how things were meant to be. It's rough out here in these streets. That's all I'm saying. And twans. All right, we're looking really good, I think. This is how I envisioned it. Let's see. Give me a little pushback. Whoop. Shield's going to pop, but we've got a shield up. Okay, nice. They're mid on helped out. Everyone's shielded. This looks good. Gwen is so good. I love her. You got to love the girl, huh? Let's shield up. Maul, you want to do something? Yeah, sweet. All right. All right, let's get this going. Yeah, the Valk exclusive has certainly given us peace of mind. I mean, there's there's, there's a clear solution, if I'm being honest, to do this without it. Um, let me 1x this. We could have Vortex uh, here pointing to the right, and then we could have Nocturne here pointing left. But uh, it's nice that I just don't have to think about it. You know, there's no special timings or nothing. I like that. So this is going to be the last big thing from the right, as we know. Nice. Yep. Yeah, snag that. Yep. Yeah. Looking good. No one's dead. That doesn't count as a death, right? Chat, let me know. Uh, retrieval does not count as a death, correct? I mean, obviously it doesn't, but I'm still anxious. It does not. Okay, sweet. Shmir doing a little damage, getting a little tickle action going. just drowning in water simple as that and we got it baby we got it baby go go all right that's three stars now so all we have to do is the stupid infernal tomorrow that is my mistake and my sincere apologies so if you're watching right now live on twitch.tv forward slash fastidious underscore gg i apologize however if you're watching the video we will be cutting right now to when I just finish that Infernal and I pull this ticket. So don't think you're coming out here blue balled, empty handed. We are done. We've got two stars left. And I guarantee you it is either, it, maybe it's even earlier, but it's certainly not stage 11 or 12 because I remember months ago when I did that. Those are definitely three starred. So it's going to be something completely easy and mindless. My Infernals are brokenly good. I did this back in the day without a lot of those top units and with Pyros. Now I have an A1 Twin Fiend and I've got all the top Infernal units aside from Soul Cadence. We will completely cook. It will be a first try slappy dappy. Don't, don't worry at all. Uh, and then, yeah, I'm going to snag these two, which is perfect. I've been saving this for so long, hoping for an amazing 2x by 15x, and it is coming. Lucius, please come home. 
and I've got these this little nasty thing. So we'll snag that. Guys, thank you so much. Let's pop over to the future now, a couple hours from now. Trial of the Infernal, two easy stars, and the legendary hero packed. Okay, we have returned. It's like 12 hours later for anyone who is watching live now. We're on twitch.tv forward slash Vicidius underscore GG. If you missed it yesterday, I beat all the faction trials, or so I thought. I only had Northerners 11 and 12 remaining, but wouldn't you know it, I was two points short. Where were those two points? Well, it was Infernals 7. <laughs> Infernals 7. You can't make this up, folks. You can't make this up. Infernals 7. So we're going to do this. We're going to quickly just pull my free legendary. And I'm manifesting, baby. Pop off for me, chat. I am manifesting Twin Fiend. I want a sweet, sweet, sweet little Twin Fiend. Let's get after it. So let's just make sure that we're wearing gear. Uh, you can see I've got good heroes for this, uh, if I do say so myself. Let's just make sure, like, key heroes have any semblance of gear. I'm going to be so over-frickin-tuned for this. This is all fine. Honestly, this is fine. Let's hop in. Let's go. Uh, let's do it. Let's do it. Come on. It's Tordor time, baby. All right. I think Tex will just automatically delete this fool. This absolute clownorama. I forgot that it's a different map on these early stages. Fool. Me Tex. He will delete you. I think basically as long as no one dies, we win. That's all it is. I think that's the rules on this one. Come on, sexy hexy. Let's go. I'm as a bee. I should have known better. And twans. Oh no, there's a thing down here. No, 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 no. Oh no. Run it back. Whoopsie dipsy. But yeah, we're manifesting Torador. Simply put, what more do you need to know? Manifest, manifest, manifest. Manifest destiny. All right, come on, Nocturne, just delete. Yes, yes, that's why I like stage seven. Let's go, stage seven. My, like, quick equip Nocturne looks like the most OP unit in the game. That's what we like to see, baby. Uh, it's just a waiting game. We're, it's already done. Everything we've deployed will already beat this. There's nothing left to do. I think, yeah, we don't even need an ult. GG's in the ch -ch 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 chat. Um, so let's just talk about it while this finishes up. Who would I like to see? <laughs> Some people in chat are rooting for A2 Shamir, which would be very funny because I should have beaten this six months ago, but I didn't have Shamir, so I didn't have three Northern Mages. I don't have Ajax. Uh, so then I pulled Shamir, and then I procrastinating for two weeks. In those two weeks, of course, I pulled another Shamir, so now I have A1 Shamir. It would be very sad, but very funny if I did get A2 Shamir. Um, I wouldn't mind getting Salazar. I would love to get Fairsi. I would love to get Razak. These are all heroes I do not have. There we go. Those should be the stars. Uh, someone's saying Incoming Anai. That wouldn't be too fun. Uh, a lot of people rooting for bad results. I have the worst Lord luck in the game, guys, so maybe we continue our manifestation and we are going to get Torador. A sweet little Torador. There we go. No, no dragging this out any longer, guys. I want to do this last night. There are our tickets, and I also... Whoa, what's the trouble? What's that? How's that fast? What? Whoa! A4 said Trump. A4 said Trump. <laughs> it happens that fast? I thought it would go to my, my thing, and I would go click it, and we would do a little print. <laughs> Baby. Ooh la la. A4 said Trump. I'm assuming it's penetration? Yeah, we'll take 8% pen on my absolute filth monster of a Cetrum. It's not what we need, let's be honest. We didn't need A4 Cetrum. Shout out to my girlfriend who, after I was trying to pull A1 Cetrum for months and months and months, in one session, she pulled three Cetrum in a row on that banner. Pretty wild. We will take that. Uh, he joins the A4 club on my account. I've got a lot of very good A4 heroes. I've got Cetrum, I've got Arrogance, and I've got Zila too. All A4. Uh, they're saying not as good as, as A2 Shamir. I guess we'll never know. Or at least for now, we won't know. If I pull A2 Shamir, we'll do a... That'd be a funny video. Who's better, A4 Setrum or A2 Shamir? I mean, we left a lot on the table, unfortunately. Uh, but you can't... It's a great pull. But like Salazar would have been sick, right? 
Um, I really, really, really want Razak still uh, just for my, my bonuses with Reeve. Tordor would have been the greatest thing ever. Um, Araka would have been pretty cool. I started saying Araka. I think that's what I want to start saying now. It just it actually sounds more fun to say. We could have picked up an Ajax. We could have picked up a Venoma. Uh, that's it. We can't get Seraphine or anything like that. But there we go, man. It was worth it. We're done. Done, Zoe. Uh, last key thing. So the only place for my attention now is going to be Guild Boss 2 Electric Boogaloo. Uh, and I'm definitely going to go for 50k this week. Look out for the pulse parties. Because, I, I mean, if I can just get one or maybe four copies of Lucius. Ooh, it's going to be a party out in here. Thank you so much for watching. I've been Pacidius. If you like my stuff, absolutely obliterate that like button. Hit it so much that, that your, your keypad or your, your mouse breaks in half. That's what I like to see. Subscribe. Share with your mother. I'll see you real soon. Bye. Fastidious.